Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Sonali from It Starts at Home and I have these exciting seven books for you guys today to share. And these are for really young kids and I have made sure that the activities are very colorful and fun. Definitely the kids who are ready to go to preschool, who are going to nursery, LKG, these books are apt for them. Each book represents a different kind of topic. So all the topics that um, can be covered for a great development and overall development for a kid, whether it's like games, whether it's studying, whether it's uh, a little bit of science, little bit of brain development, little bit of English, little bit of maths, and a lot more are all covered in these books. I'm in the middle of creating them in a PDF format so that you can download them from my Etsy. Um, but before I go further, guys, if you like this video, please make sure you give me a thumbs up and do subscribe my channel and don't forget to press that bell icon so that you're notified every time we create these amazing activities for all. So let's dive in and see which book are we doing? Which book am I showing you today? The first book of the seven series books for the kids who are going in nursery, pre-K or LKG, we are showcasing the maths book first and let's get going. So here I have my handprint and it says you have to count the fingers and color in each pocket. So when I say each pocket, these are the pockets and I have already shown as an example, the yellow color is done. So you can also ask the child once they're colored that do you want to count each and every pocket? And that's how they can revise the numbers and then they will easily know that there are these 15 spots on their hand to count. Moving on to the next one, I personally love this activity and uh, let's see which one is this. It says open and count, paste the stickers on the purple post-it. So open and count. There are two dots. You have to pick up the sticker from here and you have to paste it here. So it's a great activity in terms of pasting, in terms of flipping. So there are a lot of things that the child is involved in and is doing. And in the same way, all the three uh, numbers that are hidden here underneath, the child can see, count, pick it up and paste here. The next one is trace the numbers to reach the treat. So when it says three, the child has to trace either with the finger or with a color pencil or with paint, whatever you want to give. And there are three cookies here. So again, a reinforcement with the number versus the counting. One, two, three. The objects are right here. So one is to one donut, two is to two ice cream and still we are tracing. Moving on to the next activity. Let's look at this one first. How many? How many? Count and write the stickers for each color. Black, pink and green. All right, so you might not be able to see the green color. I think it's because of the lighting, but you have the black ones right here. You have the pink ones and then you have the green ones. The child has to count. If your child is not ready to write, that's absolutely all right. They can just count. And if you think you can encourage the child to write, maybe you can um, put the answer as just the tracing numbers and they can trace it right here. The next one is match the same count stickers, okay? So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So this is going to match here. Same respectively, this to this. Count them, shells and fishes. Again, guys, I have just repurposed one of my sticker books, so empty sheets um, and made an activity out of that. Color the pictures with number five. So I have written the number five here. Definitely, again, a reinforcement of counting and numbers and trying to find number five. And then finding the shells and just count them. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then the fishes, one and two. So a great fun activity for a child to explore numbers and still do coloring and still do counting and exploring new things. Stamp time. Let's thumbprint against each number and time. So you can make sure that you have some kind of a color on your child's thumb. And while it says two, can thumbprint two times, three, five, and four. Tick tock, clickety clock. Fill in the missing numbers and the stickers are given. So I have 12, 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10. Make sure that you show a clock in the house and the child let the child observe the numbers and let's see whether the child is able to find these numbers that are already there. The rest of the numbers are right here. 
so i have all the activity all the stickers that are required to do this activity i have pasted on the end of the page to make the activity interesting and easy and everything contained in one book and easy to do the next one is the hungry caterpillar paste sticker and make it a long caterpillar so again we are doing a lot of counting here a lot of uh, sticker pasting and removing so a lot of fine motor skill activity here all the brown stickers are here the child can easily remove or the strip can come out easily and uh, the path is already created the child can make a really hungry long caterpillar food order make three eyes on my taco so here very specifically an instruction is given to a child and the child needs to follow uh, we are not looking for perfect eye color perfect eyes we are looking for something which is fun so the, the child is going to make three eyes here color my pizza in two colors any two colors the child has to just figure it out and color it in two color four circles in red color again uh, two instructions you have to find four circles first to color and then you need to color only in red color. Color by taco in tri-color. Front one, tri is three colors. So something that a new word can be introduced to the child and the back one just in yellow. Color the face and make one more in each row. So you, the child has to color and of course you can ask the child to count and then create one more face, a funny circle, two dots, and a face is created. So another one here, another one here, another one here, and then gradually you are also revising the numbers. The counting is just easily done. Now place the stickers as per instructed on numbers. One, three, five, and seven are black color. So make sure this activity is done um, during breaks and the whole book doesn't need to be done in one day. You can pick and choose a day where you will either do just maths or in one of the activities, you could just pick up one as maths, one as the brain development, one as science. So every day, one or two pages of any one of the books can be done very easily. So just coming back to the activity, two, four, six, nine, orange color, one, three, five, seven, black, eight and 10 is green color. The stickers are right here for each one of them. The child has to pick up the sticker and paste on top of the number. Picture represents a number, find the picture and say the number or place the number sticker. So again, it's a sticker activity. If your child is not ready to write, uh, there are stickers of the numbers given at the back. The stickers are right here. The child has to remove and place them here. So this is a great, again, multi-level step activity for a child to just understand. With these kind of activities, please be patient. Let the child understand. Enjoy the sticker process. Look at the numbers and maybe just tell them, do you see a rainbow? A rainbow is six number. Let's find number six and pick it up and put it here. Or let the child just say it for the first time when you're doing the activity. Um, just the first time and the next one you can ask the child to write the numbers and here we are guys this is the end of the book and I'm sure it's a lovely book and you all would have loved the book if you really like it guys give me a thumbs up make sure you leave comments and ask me if you need any particular books that I want uh, that you would want me to create uh, rest of the series coming up in the coming weeks thanks for watching guys see you next time